wondering what I'm doing. Just hacking into Super Supper to give everyone in Petri a free burger. Those capitalist pigs need to spread a little wealth around. What about you? I figured you were trying to leave this despotic dump. Good luck with that, homegirl. Well, guess I'll get back to hacking this burger megacorp. You should take a snooze. For the road. Don't know yet, but it seems like something big is going to go down. See, I guess. Alex, you there? I'm here. There's a receiver inside. Not bad, right? Built it myself. It's safe, Alex. Totally safe, Mr. Ursus. Like always. He's a friend. I'm helping him in his club in exchange for info. Info on my bio parents. They were in his club, too. I'm about to switch on them. You know what, Alex. And I need to know if there are any, uh, you know what, in the area. Look, I'm gonna level with you. Maybe it's stupid to do so, but I feel like I can. Mr. Ursus has an illegal radio, and he wants me to check on the cops to see where they are. I heard that, Alex. Guess the cat's out of the bag. Sorry, Mr. Yu. Can't help you today. Too busy trying to make it rain beef. No worries, because... Homegirl here on the bus can. Don't worry, yo. It's simple. Even an adult could do it. Go ahead. Turn the scanner on. Cerebral flatulence. Forgot the bats. Here. Just gotta put them in the right way. No sweat. Now, we gotta check the amplifiers. Open that mofo and flip the switches. just about all of the amplifiers. We need exactly eight volts to pick up the police radio. need to be very bright. By the way, Mr. Yu, when are you gonna tell me more about my... Yo, you're picking something up! Unit 8, you copy? Alva. Unit 8 here, camped outside the gas station. Not a for now. Over. Keep looking. You got donuts? Alva. Coast is clear, Mr. Yu. They're still at the old spot. Broadcast away. Mr. Yu finds spots where he can do his little radio show. You should hear his radio voice. <laughs> Cracks me up, man. Thanks, eh? And, uh, homegirl, beside, eh? And Alex, make sure you reach out to your mom, okay? I'm sure she misses you. <sighs> sure, whatever. Thanks, homegirl. Here, for your help. Now! Time to give the citizens of Petria free beef! And boom! Oh no! 
Trojan horses down. Well, at least 347 people got free burgers. I can live with that. Next stop coming up. Oh well. This is where I get off. Stay fresh, homegirl. And good luck out there. Listen to me. What you did is unforgivable. You don't want to go down this road. Are you for real? Are you threat? Go away, young bud. No, you listen to me. What you did is unforgivable. I swear to God, if you say that one more time. What do you want, kid? If you want food, sorry. Only truckers can eat here. That's Big John. I heard things about him. Shady things. Actually, yeah. Back up security for Tyrak. To ensure his victory, you know what I mean? Now get out of here before I call the cops. the problem you're putting his life in danger listen to me robert you asked a kid to make you a bomb are you stupid if anything happens to him i'm coming for you got me kid it's me can we talk no no listen please you don't want to do that. I know what I promised you, but you can't do that. Please, listen! Hello? Hello? Oh, God damn it! What are you looking at? Young blood, come over here. Sit down. Please. Listen, sorry I yelled at you earlier. I was just... Uh, angry at myself. Anyway, I feel better now that I've eaten a little something. Well, when I get emotional, I eat. What can I say? I did. Makes me sick, them saying the brigades did it. And what about you? What do you think? Maybe there are more important things than politics. Hey, I got all this food. Eat something. <laughs> hey, feeling better? Still look like you've run a marathon in the desert. Got an idea. Why don't you catch up on some Z's in my rig? Yeah.
Time to wake up, young blood. Sorry to wake you like this. Uh, how'd you sleep? Glad to hear it. That's Robert. He's the guy I was angry with on the phone. It was funny. I once considered him a friend. He asked the kid to build a bomb. The kid doesn't know what it's for. But Robert wants to use it on the cops. That's what he does. Uses kids. Did the same thing with a girl named Lola in 86. talking to. He's crazy smart, young bud. Glasses and a tiny computer? Small world we live in. He thinks I broke a promise, and I did, but I have my reasons. I promised to tell him about his biological parents. I knew them. They were in the brigades, like me. Listen, I hate to ask this, but I need your help. Thanks, kid. The kid won't listen to me. But maybe he'd listen if you gave him a call on the CB. I... I don't know. But be honest, and don't speak down to him. We gotta get him to step away from Robert and the bomb. A lot of people could get hurt if we don't. Thank you, young blood. The CB is in front of you. I told you, John, I don't want to talk. Who is this? I remember. Yeah, that was cool, homegirl. I see John's ID on the CV. He there? You're probably lying. I hate liars. Homegirl, I don't want to be rude, but why are we talking? I see. He told you what I was doing for Robert then? Look, I don't see where this discussion is going. I'm about to hang up. Please, don't lose him, young blood. I don't know, but keep him talking. Well, even if he is, I'm using him too, to get info on my parents. And sometimes, people need to be hurt for a cause. You know what Tyrex doing to teens, homegirl. Yeah. One day I'm gonna start my own company, yo. Look, I don't got much time. I promise Robert results. Don't do it, kid. You don't want blood on your hands. Believe me, I know. start. Naomi and Steven. Those were your parents' names. Naomi and Steven? Yeah. Naomi and Steven. And I know more. I'll tell you. 
What you did? That hurt me, John. Oh, I'm so sorry, Alex. I really am. I want to know more. But not from you. I'll ask Robert. Please, Alex! No! Damn it, damn it, damn it! You did what you could, young blood. It's all my fault. <laughs> 